Hi and welcome to my playhouse and today we're gonna look at this old bastard because there is a definite bonus to actually reading all of the comments that you guys uh, type down there to me because somebody told me how to do this and it's John and John has been bugging me he wants to buy this disc <laughs> he needs it and uh, well we might figure something out but uh, shipping is way too expensive and I would like to keep the discs and the computer together it just makes more sense but I actually tried this and it boots on the bloody disc if you do it right so I'm gonna show you how to do this right because I wasn't doing it right so now we have to do it right so this portable computer is a compact portable tree and to get this working correctly you have to put in the disc and well see this way is up I think it was and you push in the disc and you have to press in the button like that and I didn't do that so now we're gonna try and power it on see if it boots or if I flip the disc the wrong side around that could happen too there's a stackering 640 kilobytes in this machine and it's not able to boot so we need to press F1 and it's at least trying to boot from the disc the last time I tried this it actually worked so uh, crossing our fingers the special thing about this system is that it stores the hard drive information and now it boots so I just need to press in that button that was my mistake I think we will go for number two which is um, setup two does it know that okay setup program setup program version five points set up the CMOS battery according to setup blah 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 to run the setup program type setup and press the enter key or type test to select this that's why don't we just do it instead strike any key when you're ready okay and it goes back and we can probably type setup so instead of just bringing it to number two it actually just extraordinary okay so set up CMOS system options not set press enter to continue okay so we can put in a date and to, oh, what date is it probably doesn't matter we're just gonna say I think it's the nah we're gonna find the date okay it's Saturday the 8th of January okay so the day is 08 oh that's the month okay so that's 01 and the date is 00 that's 2006 no we just changed that 2017 press enter then it needs the time the time is um, 13 38 oh we need to Put some of those in between. I'll just call it 39 now. Zero, zero. Enter. Please wait. Hmm. It hasn't done anything for well three minutes now. That can't be right. I'm just gonna try and reboot it. They forgot to put a delete button on here. You can't control alt delete. Do you really have to turn it on and off? Guess we'll have to try that. Hmm. Oh, found the delete button. It's down here. That might work. So set up. Okay, now it comes with a new error. So memory size error. 
Okay, and it wants the date again. I think we'll try and give it a date that is um, old. Month 01 dash 08 dash. Let's, let's just can say that it's still in the 90s somewhere. 99. Just if this this computer might have a 2000 issue. Um, it might have more than that issue. Now it's just waiting. I'm not even getting the, the time this time. Uh, time this time. But I can try the control. I'll delete this time. Oh, that works. So I can boot it. Could it be overheating? 286 is not going to be overheating. That was before they invented overheating of processors. Oh, this time it doesn't have a memory error, so... Hmm. Please wait. <laughs> Every time the please wait comes, it fucks up. So, I'm, uh, I think I'll let it run for half an hour. Um, I'll be back if it uh, becomes interesting. Okay, this has been running for oh, at least an hour, so um, and I have booted it once just to try it, so let's just do that again. Um, oh, we could just turn it off actually um, and have it start over. I don't think this machine works anymore, sadly. System diagnostic not set, press F1. Disk is in, time and date not set, so it forgets the time and date every time I turn it off. I think there was a battery in there that I chose not to replace. Set up. Okay. This time it's doing something new. Have you completed running this program since connecting the battery? Yes, no. Um, nope, let's just say no. So we get to set the date again. Month, still January. Day, still the 8th. Year. Let's try. And we get to set the time this time. The hour. Oh, many hours has gone. Let's just... Where's my phone? Uh, 15.19. And it just dies. Um, it doesn't go further than that. I can see on my phone that it has been two hours since uh, I started this, so it's dead. So unfortunately, even though we did get a bit further now that it can actually read the disks, but well, the computer is just not working. There's something wrong with it. It seemed that I was able to get a little further when it was ice cold or colder. And now that it has heated up, it dies right away. So it might be a heat problem or something like that and I'm not gonna be bothering uh, checking that out. So. Well, I just thought that maybe this would be working now and that would have been awesome and that did not turn out to be the case. So thank you very much for watching my videos. Do subscribe to my channel so that you can see me again and have a really nice day. Bye bye.